guys going downstairs to throw away my old over the range microwave getting that thing down sucks i will never ever put a microwave above a stove again just gonna go with the strict over the counter on the counter micro much easier all right here it is here's the old microwave that was over the range honestly i probably could have fixed it but i just don't got the time okay as you can see like right over my shoulder that is where the microwave used to live but it came down all I did was I put some drywall compound there, some joint compound in there, and um, you know I kind of textured it up so that it, it's a little bit more raised. And then I'm gonna paint in gray to match that wall there, so that should be pretty sick. Uh, but let me show you how I did. It's pretty easy to do, um, and if you got an area that is kind of beat up and you've patched over a while, that's a really good way to raise up the wall so that you can't see the damage anymore. All right, guys, we're just gonna put some texture on this wall. It's known as a knockdown pattern, or there's a whole bunch of different names for it, but this is basically where the microwave was hanging over the stove. So you're just gonna take your trowel like this, and you're just gonna kind of, you know, smudge it over like that, and just make a pattern of some sort and, and mix it up like that. And this is the kind of look I'm going for, it's just like that. Just some kind of texturing on there to make it uh, look different. Ooh, dug in there in the bottom, but that's fine. The more aggressive and more random the pattern looks, the better. Uh, that's kind of what I'm going for. And that's going to help me fill in this gap because the hood is going to be sitting right on top of there. Here is a look at the final product. All you got to do is let it dry and it's ready for paint. And it's really tough to stop because it's like spreading icing on a cake. Really good idea. I think a project for you and your kids to get a hold of. Uh, and all I got to do now is just get up in the morning, paint it gray, and then mount the range hood and uh, I'll be done.